Now that we've created the account, let's log in and get synced up with Clover. When you log in for the first time, you will be given a guided tour of Stockit. Feel free to skip this in favor of these videos. Take a minute to orient yourself. On the left is the main navigation bar. From here you can navigate to the home screen, see your shopping cart, select a different store, if you have multiple ones, view your vendor orders, review and edit your order guides, see your store items, view and set up your vendors, see their vendor products, create and review your various inventory lists, and review reports about your store's performance. You can also always visit the setup guide and the help sections. For now, let's go straight to the store items section. Right now it's empty. To import all your inventory items from Clover into Stockit, simply click the button at the top labeled Import Sync All Clover Items. Depending on the number of items, this process may take a few minutes. There is no hard limit on the number of items that will be synced, and we have many stores with over 10,000 items. Once the sync is complete and you have reloaded the page, you should see all your Clover items. In my sample store, I only have a couple of sandwiches and drinks. You can view each item on its own screen, which will give you a lot of useful information about that item. We will review this functionality later, as it is rich and powerful and it will take a little bit of time to explain. For now, let's go back to the store items screen.